This is Dylan McKeon from St. Ignatius Hockey and Ohio Sportsnet. This is Chris Revenue with St. Ignatius Hockey and this is Ohio Sportsnet.
Yeah, it's always uh, <laughs> always one of the most fun games of the year. So I hope they're spirited for that game. Yeah, it's two good teams. You see, it was a real close, uh, tight fought game, uh, one goal game. So uh, it was good for us to see we can win a game like that. I think both teams, you know, sometimes we win games like six to one. We're sitting there going, boy, what happens when we get in the close ones? So we want to see how they respond, and uh, they did a pretty good job. Oh, it was huge to get up, yeah. That was very important. Chris Rebner, I think, got the rebound goal. And it's going to be, uh, you know, we call uh, garbage goals, you know, kind of grinder goals. Chris is a good grinder. And uh, it's not going to be pretty goals against St. Ed's, and hopefully vice versa for them against us. It's going to be, you know, five feet away, tops, and uh, who has some composure with the puck. It seemed like second period, your boys came out hitting. They came out physical. They wanted to send a message. Yeah, we always like to hit. I mean, we, we work out, uh, you know, pretty much all year round for, for this purpose. We're not afraid to hit. We, we, I think 10 years ago, we were probably the weakest team in the league in terms of hitting, so we made a point to change that. And we've been, for the last five years or so, one of the better hitting teams in the league, so we'll never change that. We love playing that way. That's the way the game's meant to be played, so uh, I know they like the same kind of style, so it's a great game. How much did the playoff games back your boys' minds come in? Not too much. It's a different year. You know, it's, we didn't really talk about it at all, really. Um, talked about potentially this year's playoff game, you know, it's usually, you know, three round fights, so we might play them now and maybe play them in the city championship uh, tournament and then play them in the district tournament, so um, every time we play them, it's a good game, so I'd, I would play them 30 times if we could because it brings out the best in us. Oh, so much fun. Just the student sections coming out there really loud today uh, from both teams. It's really fun. And then also just you know the kids you're playing against. Oh, it's a lot of fun just getting to play them, and then, but then once the game starts, it's kind of just like another game. That's what we try to treat it like. And so, uh, I think that's just kind of our approach to the game is just treat it like another game. Uh, have fun with it though, and uh, most importantly, win. Get the big two points for the lead. How about you put up a stop there? Yeah, yeah, I mean, I was. The defense was really good today. I think Ryan Russell had that shot, but he was awesome defensively. Matt Wiegand's always really good. Uh, and they helped me out a lot, and uh, a lot of those saves. It's a pretty big win, as always. You know, it's fun to just beat them on their home ice. It's a big rivalry as it is, but I think most importantly is we're trying to win the division. So uh, getting the two points on the road is very good for us. It's always a big game to play St. Ed's. Uh, having all the students here, the big crowd, it really gets you going. You know, all your friends watching in the stands makes it a lot, a lot more fun to play in that empty arena somewhere. I think it was Brian Russell shot the puck. We had, and then we just did what our, our line does. We stand in front of the net, we pound rebounds, and popped it in. That was a good feeling, good feeling to get up early and set the tone for the game. Dylan had a great game today, uh, phenomenal goaltending. So we like, that's uh, Dylan McKeon we like to see and hopefully we'll have him for the rest of the year. It's an ugly game. I think uh, I think the shots were down 26 to 18 or something. I think we outshot them. Um, we, we gave up a power play goal. It was a, it was a grind them out game and they scored a nice goal and got the, got the game winner. And that's usually what happens in a game like that with us and them. You know, the spirits are high, kids are a little bit nervous. So you're not going to get the greatest hockey game initially for, out, of, out of everybody. but. Uh, it's played well, both both sides. You know, I don't care what we're doing. I always say, if there's people playing checkers, you know, St. Ed's Ignatius guys are always gonna, you know, it's always gonna draw a crowd. They're they're a very physical hockey team, as we and we know they're gonna try to push you around. And uh, you know, we, we got pushed around for a little bit, but then kind of answered the answered the bell a little bit. And you know, we ended up with 26 shots on goal, and I thought we just uh, we just couldn't, couldn't get any past Dylan. It's a prize fight. We know that. This is just the, this is the first round of a, of, a, of a lot of battles. We're probably gonna see him in the GLHL. Probably gonna see him at states. We know that. So we're just. You have to get better every week and you know, focus on what we didn't do well today and uh, improve on it.